Okay, let's go on to Capricorn. Let's see what happens. Okay, lack of sleep, stuck, stagnated energy, financially dependent, emotionally strong. You're seeing some non-committal energies come in and out. You might be wanting something more of a twin flame. So you're keeping your vision high, open, great. You're gonna to wanna to remove yourself from some sort of connection or weekly something or because it's clouding your judgment and it's kind of dragging your energy down. Um, you're above it. You don't need to involve yourself into it, with it. You have shades of Ten of Pentacle here, which is super cool. Whatever it is that you're working on, turning your home into that Ten of Pentacle. It's also the status of your finances as well. So how you transform your home life is involved with your whole kind of financial structure and, and financial system, house. Like a moving legacy that doesn't pertain to just your house or your apartment, but it's this moving, ever-evolving thing with your name on it, essentially. Your legacy. It's a card of legacy here. So you're working on that. It takes time, it takes self-love, self-care. So yeah, I'll just say that if you keep on holding on to negative connections, there will be a tower moment. So I'm not trying to scare you. I'm just saying that like, you could go the easy way, you could go the hard way. I would just not involve myself with certain people. I think it's spirit's way of saying like, don't do it. All right, let's roll on over to Capricorn. 